The commercial use electricity dates back to the 1870s with the use of arc lamps. The first complete electric network, developed in 1882 by Thomas Edison, was based on the DC theory. Pearl Street Station, New York City, USA, DC system rated at 110 volts, underground cable, steam engine driven DC generator. 1880s, development of the transformer and AC transmission by L. Gollard and J.D. Gibbs of Paris, France. 1880s, George Westinghouse secured rights of these previous developments in the USA. 1884, development of motors by Frank Sprague. Motor loads were added to the system. Frank Sprague is considered the father of electricity traction. 1886, William Stanley, an associate of George Westinghouse, developed and tested a commercially practical transformer and AC distribution system at Great Barrington, Massachusetts, USA. 1886, limitations of DC systems, power transfers only a short distance. Since electrical energy losses are dependent on the value of the resistance times the square of the current, the voltage level must be high to minimize losses. DC voltages levels had not developed enough to transmit electric power over long distances at that time. 1889. The first AC transmission line was put into operation in Oregon, between Willamette Falls and Portland, USA, 4,000 volts, single-phase line, over 221 kilometers. 1886. Development of polyphase systems by Nikola Tesla. By 1888, Nikola Tesla held several patents on AC motors, generators, transformers and transmission systems. 1890s, Westinghouse bought the patents of Nikola Tesla, and they formed the basis for the present-day AC systems. 1890s, 60 Hz was adopted as standard in USA, and 50 Hz was adopted as a standard in the UK for the frequency of AC systems. 1893, the first three-phase line in the USA, 2,300 volts, 12 kilometers line in Southern California. 1900. Development of AC and DC voltage levels. Early AC systems were rated at 12, 44 and 60 kilovolts. 1950. The development of mercury arc valves allowed high-voltage DC, HVDC, transmission systems to be economical in special situations. 1954. First modern commercial application of HVDC. Interconnection between Swedish mainland and the island of Gotland. 1972. First application of HVDC using thyristor valves. Connection between the power systems of Quebec and New Brunswick, Canada. 1997. First application of HVDC using IGBT valves, rated DC voltage plus minus 10 kV, Sweden. 2010. First application of the modular multilevel converter for HVDC power transmission. Rated DC voltage plus minus 200 kV, Trans Bay Cable, San Francisco, USA. Earliest 21st century. Advances in commercial applications in low voltage DC networks, interconnections among AC and HVDC networks, energy storage, renewable energy and smart grids.